camera is rolling. Okay, welcome to Moore Richardson. Today we're going to restring the 103B microphone boom. First thing that we're going to do is we're going to take the handle. We're going to turn it so that it's in this position. Make sure that it's in the down position. Okay, now what we're going to make sure is number two is that these pulleys up here is going to house the string. See that we have two holes, one there and one one on each pulley. We want to make sure that each one of these is a, in the up position. The other thing that we're going to end up doing is this thing here, this assembly right here, needs to be all the way to the front and locked in place. And the way we're going to do that, we're going to attach a string here, and we're going to tie it over here to the the knob of this here so that we can make sure that it doesn't move. Let's lock it in position. Second thing that we're going to look at is that when you take the back cap off, that when you look down inside here, that the string is around that pulley, not off of it, but it has to be in the groove, and then it has to come out over here and come out this hole. Okay, so now what we'll do is we'll restring this portion of it and then we'll go to the front of the microphone boom where we actually do the, uh, the actual uh, boom itself. Okay, now. string that came out of the hole, then goes over the, the pulley on that thing, and that assembly, and now it comes back down this way, it goes underneath the pulley, up on top, and now goes to the, to the top pulley, and that hole that we mentioned earlier, we stick it through the hole, And at that end, we tie a knot. Pull on it, and then we wrap it. We take the cord, the string, and wrap it clockwise. So you get it down to a certain point. And then now what you do is you take the, the adjustment back here and you tighten it up. So that you get tension, tension on the string. All right. Now the next, the next, what we do next is we come down here to the front of the boom. Now here, where we take this pulley assembly off of here, here's the string that comes out from the rear. We want to make sure that it goes through this pulley system in the groove, just like this and then we reattach it. The other thing that, you, that helps you to do this is that you take the end of the string to keep it from falling out. We then we then put it to hold it or we can tape it so that it doesn't fall out of the groove of the pulley. So now we take that string that we made sure that we had it locked in the groove. <coughs> Bring it down to the to the to the main wheel and we go we count eight we count eight eight threads in. One, two, three, four, about five, six, seven, eight. And that's where he starts the cord, puts it underneath. And then this, here now, we we 
follow the follow the groove that we started in then down at the bottom. And you will notice now that the cord that he just brought over the top, okay, now goes on the in between the string now and the, the base. And we're going to wrap that around now four times, four loops, in the clockwise direction. Okay, now that we have it looped around four times, making sure that each loop is in, is in a thread or a groove, now we bring it over here to this pulley. Can you loosen it up a little bit? Okay, yeah. Can you show now over there? Because... Yeah. The string comes out slightly short. Okay, we can. What we can do is here we can we can very gingerly pull the, pull this out. No, no. Can you bring it in? And then we push it back in. Out from the drum, over to that pulley, in this direction, and then up. Again, we go into the hole of this pulley. Then we tie the knot. Now, with this, in this pulley, we wind the, the cord or the string counterclockwise, keeping some tension. Then he takes the uh, adjustment there and he tightens it, turns it clockwise so that the pulley turns and we end up tightening up the cord. Then again, he's gently feels that there's tension on here. Same thing on the back one a little bit more. Now we re release the, the string that we put on there to pull the pulling assembly up against the stop. And that is, that is the restringing process. To verify that it works, we go in a clockwise direction. Out goes the boom. We bring it back in counterclockwise. And the string stays in the groove on the main hub. Then, after you do that, after it's all complete, then you can take the handle. Put it back to a normal position, and now you're done. Thank you.